how to write several sql queries using date function what are the various date function provided by sql to implement queries and do table changes by sql hello everyone i'm sukanya from go edu hub technologies and today we are going to discuss that how can we write sql queries using date functions the very first date function is now function it returns the current date and time of the system for that there is a very simple query select now and it will display you the respective date and the time you can see here today's date 7th jan 2021 and the time 4 o'clock 58 minutes and 36 second the next is if you want to return only the date not the complete date and time then you can select the function cur date it will return you the current date of today's system and today's current date is 7th jan 2021 similarly if you don't want to return the date and just want to return the current time then you can use the function cur time let me execute this query in my sql command line and you can see that the current time of the system is 4 o'clock 59 minutes and 16 seconds the next is date if you want to extract a date part or a date time from any expression you know that we have already created a table named abc in our system and this is the table abc which we have already created id name department marks and section a new field which i have added is the date of birth of students this is the respective date of birth now if i want to extract only a particular part from this date for example the year part the month part or the date part then how can we do that what would be the query so the query will be if i select the name of the student and the date of birth dob as birth date from abc so this will return me the complete date of birth of the student so let me see if the query is executable yes it is along with the name the dob is extracted as birth date here the field name is dob but i have changed the field name as birth date for this query next if i want to extract a single part of this date and time a single unit then the syntax will be extract unit from the date function for example if i want to extract name and extract day from the dob as birth day from the table abc so let me execute this query and see that how it runs or what execution it exactly performs so it returns me the birth day that when the day occurs that is 2 to 10 of the month first of the month and 8th of the month so this is the birth day next if you want to extract the year from the date of birth that in which year the particular student has taken birth then we can also use the extract the year from dob function and when i execute this query as birth year then the respective years have been extracted in place of the complete dob so this is how extract function works next is date add adds a specific time interval to a date using this field you can add a specific time interval to the date that with the date along with the date at what time the particular student has taken birth in that interval you can also add for example if uh, select name and date add dob interval 1 year as date modified from the table abc so if i want to run this query you can see here the date modified from the abc of with the interval of 1 year so here the birth year of ankit is 1998 but the interval of 1 year means the increment of 1 year in the birth date so it means 1 year has been incremented in each of the year of birth of respective students so this is how date add function works similarly date subtraction function works as if you want to add a, just the difference of that particular date and subtract the given interval of that time then you can add the subtraction function also the next function is date diff 
it returns the number of days between two days that what is the difference between the two dates if you want to calculate that then it will give you and return you the value in format of days for example if i want to calculate the difference between 1999 month is 8 and the day is 2 that means 2nd of august 1999 to the 1998 09 month and 5th day of that particular month and i want to calculate the difference between both the days then i can use the sql query which i am executing here and the difference between both the date is of exactly 331 days the next is format of the date if you want to display the format of date which means in which format exactly the date is storing sometimes the format is year month date and sometimes the format is exact opposite date month and year so if you want to display that format then you can use select date format date comma that particular format for example if i run this query in my sql command line and see the format of date then here i can see the date format of now means today's date is 7th jan 21 in year format that is date the month and the year whereas previously you can see the format is year the month and the day in numeric form but now here you can change the format using the string format of january which is short form is jan so this is all the date function being used to write several sql queries and you can see the changes also in the tables if you want to make for further queries you will look into more videos thank you